Hey guys, this is Josie in Chicago. Just wanted to give you a quick update here on eSync. If you are using the eSync program, it is a free program, free software you can use to drop ship on eBay. It's absolutely free to sign up. There is no monthly fee, which I love about this program. On top of that, you have different stores that you can choose from, as you can see here in the drop down. You can uh, there's a couple Amazon locations, different countries that you can source from, as well as AliExpress, Best Buy, BH Photo Video, Costco, Kmart, Lowe's, which they just finished adding, Overstock, Sam's Club, Sears, and Walmart. Now, Lowe's is still not in the software, but um, as far as the drop down for eSync, which I'll show you in a minute, but uh, they should be there hopefully within the next week or so. Sam's Club has been added to eSync for a while now, but they also were not working for the last week or so, but now that is up and running again. So I'm going to source from Sam's Club. I just did Sam's Club about an hour ago. I forgot to record, so I already loaded some stuff from Sam's Club, but I want to show you that, so I'll probably load about three or four more things just to show you, and we'll go through that right now. If you don't have eSync as of yet, check out the link underneath this video will be the affiliate link for you guys to join eSync uh, and um, again it is an affiliate link and I make very little off of it but if you want to try it great go ahead and try it and if you're using something else that's uh, absolutely perfect as well you gotta find what works for you uh, but eSync has been the easiest software and that I have used so far so that's why I'm testing them out for the next 30 days but we'll go ahead and test it here if you want to join eSync for free go ahead and hit the link underneath this video as well as my number one recommendation for working at home will also be underneath this video so check that out that is also free to join and free information for you guys okay let's go ahead and get started with eSync then uh, first we're going to go over to Sam's Club so let's do that Okay, here is Sam's Club right here, and we can see what they have. Um, let's see. I just finished listing some of this stuff here, so I, want, I don't want to list the same thing, but let's check out some patio furniture sets, since spring is around the corner. Don't let these big numbers here scare you. Sometimes these bigger ones actually sell very nice, and you get a nice profit off of them. So let's say I want to pick this. So, uh, we will go up here. There you go. So you guys can see. So here's a little eSync, right? Uh, app that you would. This is the Chrome application that you would have already had uh, installed in your Chrome. So you click on there. See, it's got all the storage right here. It's got Sam's Club. It's missing Lowe's, but it should be on here soon. These are the 48 that I did earlier, so I'm going to go ahead and delete that by just clicking on it to the garbage can. And I'm going to hit the rocket ship. The rocket ship is going to go ahead and grab the links on this page and then jump to the next page. But I'm only going to pick these five for now. I'm going to... Actually, I'm going to pick the next page as well, page two. Oh, it's only got one page. So we're going to go ahead and copy by clicking here. And then we're going to go back to our eSync, which is right here. Go to drop down, and it's already on Sam's Club, but just in case you were not. Go to Sam's Club. I'm going to enable it. Select. I always select uh, another title to see what they come up with. I'm going to do a right click and hit paste. Those are the five. I'm going to go ahead and do with preview. I never do without preview because there are sometimes the listings come up on the blacklist for eBay and you don't want to list anything that's on the blacklist for eBay because it's on, if it's on the Vero list and you list too many of those eBay will suspend your account and we don't want to take that risk. So right now it is loading up. We'll wait for that to load for a minute or two. And there it is. It is loaded. So it's telling you that none of these have sold as of yet on eBay, which could be, a, it's not a bad thing either. Nothing came up on the blacklist. If it is, it would have been right up here. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to approve all five of these. Uh, these would have, this would be my profit, which is very nice profit right now, considering I don't have any competition except for this one. 
uh, and my price is the same price as theirs so uh, we're good to go there the titles if I want to change the title I can always click on this and change the title if I wanted to but I'm gonna keep it as is for right now I'm going to approve all five and say just approve See now, this is the good thing. This is it already exists, already exists. So these two are already on eBay. So it helps you from making double uh, listings. So we'll go ahead and reject those two since they're already on eBay. Which means the other three, as you can see, it took about 10 seconds. They are already listed on eBay. And if we want to see what that is, let me just go over to eBay right now so that you can see. You can click on here. And there it is, the listing is on here. Now it says this item is out of stock. So I'm going to just double check my listing again. But there's the listing with the pictures and everything else. Very nice, very clean. Let me just go right back to eSync to double check that. All right, here we are back on eSync. Let's just go to reports and out of stock. And yep, there they are, out of stock. There's three of them so I'm gonna go ahead and click on here delist those say okay yes I want to delist them and now they're off my eBay store I try to clean up anything that's out of stock I take it out right away I like to add new things to my store at all times because they just people like to see new things in your store so the more stuff you can add the better I do have stuff at home that I buy from like sales that I find at Walmart or Target or Kmart or even the garage stores or even the second hands, the Goodwills and stuff. Sometimes I'll go in there and find some uh, nice stuff that I know sells. So I have a mixture of stuff that I have at home and then of course the stuff that I drop ship from all these different stores. But this is a great system, great software for you to use if you are thinking of drop shipping, if you want to start your business with eBay. Uh, eSync is definitely one of the easiest ones I've seen. Again, if you want to sign up for free, the link is right underneath this video. Go ahead and try it out. Um, you can try it for a month. It's absolutely free. Uh, they only charge you when you do the listings, and listings are super cheap. So I think you guys will get a lot of value out of eSync. Uh, also, again, my number one recommendation for work at home is also underneath here. Also free to join and get some free information on that. So I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. Happy listing and have a great week. Don't forget to hit that like button and uh, hit the little bell icon so that you guys can know every time I put up a new video. Have a good day everyone.